Yo, what's up guys? Today we're watching more Family Guy. And if you guys want us to watch more gay Family Guy episodes, get this video to 12,000 likes. And if you insist on seeing more content, then check out our Patreon and subscribe so you never miss an upload. Somewhere in Ohio, uh, uh, Afghanistan. I know what year this episode came out, like the early 2000s, back when it was okay to just be racist as fuck. You will be punished for your decadent ways on the first day of Radaman. <laughs> Radamon, bro. Osama's kind of- uh, he's kind of funny. He's kind of got jokes! Got a good affect to him. Family Guy made Osama likable. <laughs> Finally, someone's doing it. Who, who is that guy? I've never seen him around here before. <laughs> How's it going, Chief? Good day to you, sir. <gasps> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Stewie Griffin is an American hero in today's episode of Family Guy. <laughs> What the fuck? This is awesome. That is like one of the best intros to a Family Guy episode. Gay Pride Parade. <laughs> what the fuck is going on right now? <laughs> Why is he nailing the garbage to the ground? Oh, God, don't tell me you forgot about Meg's play tonight. But Lois, Meg sucks. <laughs> Stop making fun of Meg! She's cute and deserves a pat on the head. She is not cute. Look at the fucking terrifying. Peter, you're going to Meg's play and that's that. <laughs> Now, are you gonna go to Mexico? <laughs> Holy shit, riding him like a pig, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we love Lois. I like eating red carpet. Did he die of horniness? What the fuck was it? Man, this sucks worse than my 16th birthday party. Thanks for coming to my birthday party, Jake Ryan. He looks exactly the same. What the fuck? Here's your present. No, Jake, not like this. Oh, oh my god! Peter was right. In other news. This episode's amazing. This is a 10 out of 10 episode. Am I wrong? It's like, everything is amazing. I looked up the funniest Reddit Family Guy episodes. The funniest Family Guy episodes according to Reddit. And Reddit said this was funny and I trust Reddit with my life. I want to show you- They're censoring TV and Peter doesn't want to censor it. So he makes his own TV station. <laughs> I'm not supposed to tell mom because she's just going to bitch him out. Best character. Funniest character. Greatest character in the show. Put him on a poster. The goats of like comedy cartoons is like Chris from Family Guy, Gene from Bob's Burgers. It's always the older brother. I don't know why the older brother is always the shittiest. Hi there, I'm Peter Griffin. And you're watching PTV with all the sex, violence, sex and violence on like TV. Episode. But where are those good old? This entire episode is against the intro song of Family Guy. He he's like the tsunami robot, where he's the in between between each episode. He's like, I'm Peter Griffin. I'm back. So do you like that uncensored episode? He's literally creating the 24/7 Family Guy live streams that are all over the platform. <laughs> That's amazing. Well, Lois, there is absolutely nothing inappropriate about my programming. Welcome to Midnight. Whoa! I don't like Quagmire. Quagmire has never been a great character, you know what I mean? You guys are stupid, and you should die. He's awesome. There are plenty of things that are much worse for children than television. Like when Peter babysat for the neighbor's kid. Peter has killed many children. That's the moral of this episode. Is it worse to show children mature television shows or to kill them? Well, both of them will lead to death. So if they see a mature television show, you should just kill them on the spot, is what they're saying here. I called the FCC. I know all about the FCC. <laughs> okay. All right. You can stop PTV, but you can never stop people from being who they are. True. Or can we? <laughs> what? <laughs> he has a- They're censoring him in real life! <laughs> Chin looks like balls. You want me to cover that too? If Peter grew a mustache, it would just look like he has pubes on his face. You know, you're lucky you're good at <laughs> my <laughs> Talking about when you <laughs> lubed up toothpaste in my Toothpaste? My while you in a cherry? In my cherry? What? Lois is my dream woman now, bro. What the hell is this? The FCC has forbidden audible flatulence. Wait, they got uh, rid of fart jokes. Maybe the FCC does have something going for it. There wasn't this much tension when the slaves were free. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Gentlemen, that was a fact. This episode started off so good and I'm so over it. Like, what? I love this episode. If Family Guy episodes were like 12 minutes long, they'd be a lot better, maybe. It seems today that all you see is Ronald McDonald jerking his d 
I would love to see Ronald McDonald jerk in it. Who's more influential on the American people, Ronald McDonald or Ronald Reagan? Well, there's like trickle down economics and there's trickle down obesity. That was a trick question. They're the same person. What? That is crazy. Cleveland gets a lot of magazines. Grape soda today. Oh my god, black joke. <laughs> black joke. Is this back when Cleveland Brown was voiced by a white man? Back when his name was Cleveland Brown. That would have been a good plot. They just reveal that Cleveland Brown, the character, has been doing blackface this whole time, and they don't change the voice actor. Those four scenes of my Cleveland show is all bullshit. It's a mustache, Meg. I think it's gay. I gotta grow a mustache, bro. That's the ugliest thing the fat man's grown since that horse leg. Hey, Peter, have you seen my- I'm so sorry. What? Peter had a horse leg? Why did Peter have a- <laughs> I feel a like I missed something there. And now back to One Tree Hill. I've slowly hey, started to realize nothing. so many comedy cartoons focus so much on half the episode being the characters watching fake TV shows. Ren and Stimpy does that. Simpsons does it with the Itchy and Scratchy show. Family Guy does it. If you plopped me in the middle of a high school, I could be the most popular kid there in the week. <laughs> Here's the plot. Here's the plot. Care to place a wager on that okay it's a bit great kiss on it what Oop. kiss on it <laughs> he already looks so fruity this is like before he gets impregnated right it's a lot before but it's crazy how long you know they've they've been together you know what i mean with the force rates these days i just find it beautiful that's all okay so that a baby and a dog can enjoy a, baby and a loving dog. wholesome relationship yes yes speaking italian boopy. <laughs> why, why is this funny? Why is this? <laughs> I hate that it is. It's funny. It, the fact that Brian is there makes the scene funny. Who are you? I wear long sleeve shirts under short sleeve shirts under long sleeve shirts. Wow. Oh my God. <laughs> what? He's so cool. McBurger Town is on fire. Oh my goodness. I forgot that this episode was going to be about that. It's about fast food and not about Peter's mustache. No, with great mustache comes great responsibility. Dude, how do we always end up watching Spider-Man? Like, I'm so over it, dude. Ah! No, his mustache! No! This is obese Spider-Man. Peter, have you seen Brian? Oh my god, no. his position that he's just sitting in is hilarious. Seen. What is that on your head? It's a mustache, Lois. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you're the guy who cost me my mustache. What, did you come over here to rape my daughter? He said, did you come over to rape my daughter? What? I'd like to offer you a lifetime supply of McBurger Town Burgers. Free burgers? So we got lifetime supply to this burger place, he's gonna eat himself to death. <laughs> can't really feel anything on the left half of my body. <laughs> Peter, are you winking at oh me? Oh my god, he's having a stroke. What Peter the fuck? Peter Griffin stroke, no. Oh my god, the family guy death. The classic. Oh my god, Peter, sweetheart, <laughs> Had better days, Lois. I feel uh, bad laughing at that, actually. The fast food arc lasted like 30 seconds in this episode, then we already moved on to the episode being about something completely different. Bring a beer over here. <sighs> I kind of hope the rest of the episode isn't just he has a stroke. That one was, cr that one hurt. He spilled the beer on his shirt, man. You want to go out to Apple Point this weekend? See what all the buzz is about? <laughs> Whoa! If he kills a child here, I think it'll be good, though. No, he didn't kill anyone. What? That is such- Stop mocking me! <laughs> God damn it. God, I hate, I hate that I laugh. I hate that I laugh. I've got a date with Connie D'Amico this Saturday night at Apple point ah she's a file for this this teenage girl is about to go to a point well i mean as far as she knows it's a really short teenager he's like one foot tall bro don't discriminate against people with like dwarfism dwarfism is a, is a serious problem in our society he's like one years old this is all your fault mcburger down i swear i'll get back at you wait if he eats more burgers maybe it'll reverse the stroke it was like cancel out his right leg looks like a penis. How long was I in there? About five minutes. Why are we not funding this? It's like the opposite of the South Park episode. They address it, they make a joke, and they move on. South Park would have spent an entire episode on the one fucking joke. That's why Family Guy is better. I'm taking a hard stance. I'll find a way with the help of my snarky cat lawyer, Meowsy McDermott. 
I love that guy. He's kind of cute. I, like I him. love him. Who is that? That's Meowzy Meowzy McDermott, McDermott, dude. You don't fucking know him. You've got to be kidding me. Are you got to be kidding me, Corey? You don't know who Meowzy McDermott is. So are we just gonna sit here and talk, or are we gonna do it? <laughs> Check this baby out. Joke. <gasps> Zach, it's, it's just a get baby. The hell out of my car. <laughs> it's a what? What is? What is even? That's it. How are we? That was how are we in this? How did his pants came back on magically? Well, how did you expect the him getting taken to a point? Maybe he could have like drove the car off the cliff and killed her, and then there's like a how to hide the body situation. I don't know, Jack. Uh, like I told you, she was a p and you guys were denying it. You don't look Asian. Well, I guess we'll just take our millions of dongs elsewhere. Wait, wait. Let me get our general manager. This episode, this episode got so bad so fast. This must be the McBurger Town slaughterhouse. If we can get you out of here, would you be willing to testify publicly about these atrocities? Oh my God, he's such a fucking liberal. I want to, I want to hit him with a Prius. Yeah, keep oppressing the cows. Hey, hey, what's up, Lucas? What the hell's your problem? Oh, he's not cool because he has a micro penis. He doesn't even have- he's just a baby. He's just a baby, so you're bro. you're saying babies don't have micro penises. They do. They do have micro <laughs> They do. We all used to have micro penises, but we grew out of it. <laughs> we don't even mean used to. <laughs> That's a good point. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. Look! This girl is making out with a baby! Ah, hey! That's right. To hell with you. Here comes the story of the so confused. That was hard. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't Why know is what... the episode not over after that? That that would have been the perfect place to, as he walks his bare ass away. The <laughs> credits start to roll from the top of the screen. That's right. I bought a horse. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's him. The horse is here. The horse. Who? 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 It's the horses here episode. The horses here. It's the horses here. The horse. What are you talking? Why? Why is the horse here? Peter. The horse is here. Everybody pee now. We're an unusual family. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. The horse is here. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. She said it, dude. <laughs> I was here, bro. I was here for this. Hey, you want a sugar cube, horsey? Oh, uh, called Brian, don't. Uh... What the fuck was that? He was with the four. Oh, oh my god, he's cheating. Why does he sl He's sleeping booty cheeks out right now. Mr. Hands, Mr. Hands, Mr. Hands. Did Peter get a job from that horse? Peter reached an orgasm he'll never reach again from that horse. And that's why Lois is afraid of the horse. I mean, horse is a thing for a reason. It's crazy how this is literally an Adventure Time episode too. Like, it's the same fucking show. It's the deer guy. No, it's with the cow in the first episode. Yeah, the poop for brains cow. Everyone, some of the milk in the fridge is not milk, it's horse sperm. Bro. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> no way, Stewie. Well, I'll just have to get a second job or something. Peter has a job? Yeah, he works at Pawtucket's okay. Brewery. We're going to inject you with the gay gene. We'll give you $125. All right, I'll do it. It would cost $125 to get Peter to suck your c Really? That's a canon moment. So write that down, guys. Write that down. That goes on the wiki. Hi. He got the gay gene? Please right in. He got the gay gene. He got gay pheromones in his fucking water. Are you gay? Guilty. <laughs> oh my god. That is a good out of context clip too. <laughs> Peta, are you gay? <laughs> Make hasn't done a single thing in any of the episodes we watched. I just noticed that she's sitting there and I'm like, she hasn't done anything. The kids that aren't Stewie just suck in this show. Well, Chris has had more lines in these episodes than Meg. Oh, my muffins are ready. But I like gay Peter. Like, he's better. He's making cupcakes. He's doing things. When has he ever cooked for his fucking family while being straight? Like, never. Is that going to be the plot twist where they all start to like Peter more when he's gay? Maybe you should go back to that doctor. Well, now, wait a minute, Meg. Okay. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. What? What? I said homosexuality is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Just keep it in the bedroom, you know? <laughs> Are you being serious? Homosexuality is wrong. Darn it. Knock, knock. What's the problem, champ? What is gonna... I'm sensing some bad things going on in the scene. 
Why is math so hard? One trick I used to use is turning things into a word problem. He's a good father. Being gay just made him a good father. For example, if there are three d***y holes in the bathroom at the club... I don't know if this is... No, he's not. No, never mind. He's teaching his son oh, deductive guys, reasoning. We now return to that... He's even gay in his bed. Well, Look how gay he looks watching TV. Well, here's the new 90 you picked Woo! up for me. What do you Marry think? me, bro. Marry me. Does this make Lois a Fujoshi? Because she's, like, married to, like, a gay guy. Fetishizing him being gay. Brian's got to fill in the shoes. He's got to be the man of the house. And he's in love with Lois, so... He looks fucking slay right now. Look at his necklace. We just have to wait for the effects to wear off. Hi, everybody! You can't just other men you're married you can't just do this i'm here i'm queer but don't get used to it because i'm leaving you he got himself a twink day two of being gay i am peter griffin homosexual you think he has like business cards that he hands out with that on it <laughs> he quits his job to be a full-time gay what the where am i this is straight camp, Peter. They put him in gay conversion camp? <laughs> Even the teacher looks gay. Hi, fellas. I sure do love being gay. Is that Choose Goose? <laughs> that sounded like Choose Goose. Yo, Choose Goose is a gay icon if I've ever seen one. Repeat every word I Look at Peter's fat ass barely holding on. And they did not have an XL. He is looking slutty at gay camp, bro. We should do a like video like Spilling the Milk Goes to Straight Camp. Like, just for the content. There's nothing I'd want more than to have you back, but your place is in Scott now. Actually, the rest of the show takes place. It's just Peter and Scott for the rest of the series. I love the base Family Guy sincere moment where they randomly become serial all of a sudden and play the sad music and zoom into the character. Like, that's the Family Guy formula. It is nonsense. And then all of a sudden, at the end of the episode, they're like, let's zoom into the character for three seconds of seriousness. You guys. <laughs> I won an 11 way. Oh, here are my notes about the gay gene. It wears off after two and a half weeks. Ooh. Ooh. Right. Who's gonna stop mid sex? Holy <laughs> crap! Ah! <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> this is his moment of realization. So, we're just like never gonna talk about this again? That's right, sweetie. <laughs> That's right, sweetie. Oh my god, the horse, the horse, but the horse is gonna show up at the end of the episode. He's gonna- I knew it! I knew it! And if you guys want the mo more horse episodes of Family Guy, then get this video to 12,000 likes! Thanks for watching Family Guy with us. I had a grand old time, I don't know about you. Alejandro Paredes, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kane Rivers, Kamalu, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Daryl Herb, Diane Stalk, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Granado, Gub Stargazer, Gummy Brain Rot, Gunny Snow Unison, Helio, I Pig, Brett Hand, Isaiah Alford, Kamui, Catherine Wright, Night VDB, Leaf, Lilac Moon, Modestry, Master Nate, Matthew Byers, Mauritz, Solomon Graver, Native, Nick, Obama Gaming, Omega Waffles, Pitch and Witch, Pimmons Best Boy, Rain, Steven Sanchez, Sunny D, Tyrant Sills, Toast, Ultimate Parson, Bell Explicit, Victoria, Wyatt Line.